The examine if closed instruction behaves very much like a normally open relay contact. When an external switch is closed, a 1 is placed at the address of the switch in the input table, and the examine if closed instruction becomes true and allows run continuity, much like a normally open relay contact will allow current to flow when its coil is energized. If the external switch is not closed, a 0 is placed at the specified address in the input table, and the examine if closed instruction becomes false and there is no run continuity through the contact. This is the same as a normally open contact on a relay whose coil is not energized. When the switch is closed, a 1 is placed in the input table. The examine if closed instruction will allow run continuity through itself, much like a closed relay contact allows current to flow. The address of the contact turns yellow, indicating logic continuity. When the switch is open, a zero is placed in the input table. The examine if closed switch will then not allow run continuity, just like an open relay contact will not allow current to flow. The examine if open instruction behaves very much like a normally closed relay contact. When an external switch is closed, a one is placed at the address of the switch in the input table, and the examine if open instruction becomes false and will not allow run continuity. Much like a normally closed relay contact, will not allow current to flow when its coil is energized. If the external switch is not closed, a zero is placed at the specified address in the input table, and the examine if open instruction becomes true, and there is run continuity through the contact. This is the same as a normally closed contact on a relay whose coil is not energized. When the switch is closed, a one is placed in the input table. The examine if open will interpret this condition as false and not allow run continuity just like a normally closed relay contact will not allow current flow when the relay coil is energized. The address of the contact does not turn yellow, indicating that there is no logic continuity. When the switch is open, a zero is placed in the input table, the examine if open will interpret this condition as true and will allow run continuity, much like a normally closed relay contact will allow the current flow when its coil is not energized. The address of the contact turns yellow, indicating logic continuity. When the two examine if closed instructions are true, there will be logic continuity on this rung to the output energized instruction. When the instructions before the output energized instruction are true, a 1 will be placed in the output table at 0 colon 2 slash 1. With the one in the output table, the physical output with that address will be turned on. If the rung is false, a zero will be placed in the output table, and the physical output with that address will be turned off. This is an example of both an examine if closed and an examine if open instruction. Both instructions reference the same input address, i colon 1 slash 0. When the switch is open, the examine if closed on rung 0 will be false, and there will be no logic continuity to the output energized instruction, and therefore the output o colon 2 slash 0 will be off. At the same time, the examine if open instruction on rung 1 will be true, allowing logic continuity to the output energized, therefore turning on output O colon 2 slash 1. When the switch is pushed closed, the logic conditions will be opposite, and O colon 2 slash 0 will be turned on, and O colon 2 slash 1 will be turned off. In this simulation, you will see the multiple variations of the use of the examine if closed and the examine if open instructions. Eight different input switches are being used by the instructions. Rung zero will only have logic continuity to the output instruction when all three of the switches addressed by the examine if closed contacts are closed. The yellow highlighting indicates that there is logic continuity 
through the instruction. Rung 1 only has an examine if open contact. In order to have logic continuity, the instruction needs to be true, which will occur when the switch at I colon 1 slash 3 is open. Rung 2 has a combination of examine if open and examine if closed instructions. As long as there is at least one path of logic continuity, from left to right, the outputs will be turned on. 